Good day, guys. Today, I want to show how to solve this simple exponential equation before us. Look at the board. The equation says if 8 power x plus 3 divided by 16 equals to 1, find what x in this case, what do we do? Come closer. Come on, learn. Solution. We bring down this guy, we have that 8 exponential x plus 3 divided by 16 equals to 1. What are you going to do? Remember, you can reduce 8 to 2 power 3. You can reduce uh, 16 to 2 power 4. So we are going to do this. We are going to have uh, 2 power what, 3 into x plus 3 divided by 2 power what, 4 equals to 1. All right, let's continue. Look at this. We can open this bracket, right? So we are going to have 2 power 3 times x is going to give you 3x. Uh, 3 times 3 is going to give you 9 divided by 2 power 4 equals to 1. Now, we are going to apply the rules of what indices. That is division rule. For example, if you have a power x divided by a power y, they are of the same base. In this case, you subtract the powers. So we are going to have a power x minus y. So I'm going to apply this same technique here. Yeah. So we are going to have, um, let me bring it here. We are going to have 2 power 3x plus 9 minus 4 equals to 1. So we are going to have that 2, uh, 9 minus 4 is going to give you what that is at 5. 3 power x plus 5 equals to 1. Remember from um, zero index law of indices, that a power 0 equals to 1. This is applicable to all numbers. If you have um, 2 power 0, you are going to have 1. 5 power 0, you are going to have 1. 100 power 0, you are going to have 1. So I'm going to put, I'm going to apply the same uh, knowledge here. Since we have 2 here, we can say that 2 power 0 is going to give us 1. So that we can have the same base. So we now have 2 power 3x plus 5 equals to 2 power 0. So in this case, they have the same base, you equate the powers. We have 3 power x plus 5 equal to 0. So 3x equals to 0 minus 5. I'm taking this side to this side. We now have that um, 3x equals to minus 5. But since we are looking for x divide through by 3, divide through by 3. So x equals to what? Minus 5 over 3. So the answer to this is that your x is going to give you minus 5 over 3, which is there answer please don't forget to share don't forget to subscribe don't forget to follow me for more lessons bye bye